In this video I'll be going through Aerotext. Aerotext is our latest solution to calling and texting from our communication devices. It's available across the Accent and the Chat device range. But for this video I'm going to be demonstrating it on the Accent 1000 with the Unity 2.0 vocabulary. Before we start, you need to make sure that you have an Android based phone. Only Android operating systems are compatible at the moment with Aerotext. Okay, so what we'll be doing is making a connection between uh, the Accent and an Android device, Android phone, through Bluetooth. So to do that, to make the connection, we'll go to Pages, the phone page. We're going to hit that Bluetooth icon that says Pair Phone. On here, you'll see that nothing is currently connected and you have two options. It may come standard with only the calling button selected. But make sure you hit calling and texting as it will give us this web address that we need to visit. That web address, you search for it on your Android phone and it will provide the page to download the Aerotext app. So that web address is prc-saltillo.com slash texting. When that loads, you'll see this page here. You can read through and learn how to install it on your phone. For now in this video, simply going to say I agree to terms and then download Aerotext. It's given me a prompt to download the file. So I'll do that and then I'll open it. On this page it's talking about permissions and if I want to allow the app to do various things I'm going to say install. This may take a few moments. What I'll do is I will... Oh, there we go. As soon as I took it away it opened it. Um, okay, so now with Aerotext uh, now downloaded we have to do two things. First we need to connect our Bluetooth and we need to make Aerotext the default texting app on the phone. So I'm going to hit the no Bluetooth connection first and it's asking to allow my phone to be visible by Bluetooth. I press allow. And now after I've done that I'm also going to head across to the accent and I'm going to go pair to phone so we can search for my phone. This may take just a few seconds. We'll, we'll wait for that. All right. On my phone, it's propped up a um, a prompt recommending type in four zeros to connect to the accent. I click OK. Right, you've noticed the Bluetooth symbol appeared up here now, and it's saying that. Um, I'm now connected, but it's saying text messaging is limited because we haven't done our second little bar here, which is to make Aerotext our default texting app. So I'll click that, and it's asking me if I want to change the default, and I'll press yes. Okay, so now that has just disappeared, and it's saying calling is supported, and text messaging is supported. Okay, so I'll click OK. And now I'm just going to head back into phone configuration and just disconnect um, this at the moment. And I'm going to uh, press OK. The reason why I'm doing that is so that when I go into this phone page, you won't see all of the contact information on this phone just for this video. But generally, what you'll find is if you want to go to the phone page, we'll head into the phone, and then this call home button. And you'll have the texting page, which will have your different conversations up here on the left. You'd click on a conversation, and that and the latest five messages will appear. You can also go to the calling page. You can scroll through your contacts with this button. Select a contact, and it will start calling through your phone. A nice way of getting to both of these is through the contacts page up here. All of your contacts in your phone will be listed. Um, you could then select a contact 
and it will prompt you to text or call. Calling will call them straight away. Texting, you'll then select what message you want to text and then it would go and send that. So that's a quick rundown of how AeroText functions on the Accent 1000 with Unity.